Gotta shoot him in his head. Got him. Dude, this those guys right there will be so hard on realism. Because those guys just tank on easy. I could imagine. What's going on, it's Johnny, and welcome to the grand finale of the Black Ops Cold War campaign. This is episode number five, if I'm not mistaken. We are gonna finish this up right here, right now. Let's do it. Die. Lanabon. Lanabon? Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? Hey, hey, Antler, can you not be a dickhead? Hold on, I, I gotta turn this audio down on my, my monitor. Give me a second. What's happening to me? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start going. Hey, man. Shut up. What did you do to me? Where's Perseus? Uh... We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Okay. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Duma. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump the bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. Oh, uh, okay. We were there. We found you after everything went down. Of course, it's framing. It's one of the best parts of this entire game, I'm sure. I mean, I can't freaking watch it because a dumb game doesn't work on Xbox. I, I can't apologize because I didn't do it. Apparently, it doesn't even work on the new next gen either. You're lying. You put the shit in my head. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. In the end, no specific background really stuck with you. You resisted everything we tried, so we just kept it a mystery. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Hmm. No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got come a job. We've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind. That's the crazy. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. What we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who in the end has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. Perseus. So tell me, where is Perseus? <clears throat> Once we control the Greenlight Arsenal, 
we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. <coughs> this is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. Solovetsky. I'll give him the truth. Sims. Get Washington. I wonder if I were to lie, it would actually. So there's like now. different endings to this. I like how they have different options. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on, you're still one of us. That's crazy. I'm excited for these new campaigns, and they're gonna keep, keep keep going this way, where they like give you different options to go up, go about things. Kind of a cool way to do it. Which obviously other games do it, but they've never really done it for Call of Duty. CIA's analysts consider him to be the single at least from I remember. To the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us will cross the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. I just don't get how it works no on the PlayStation heroes, like but four. Villains. But on Xbox, it doesn't us. work on any Xbox. As for me, Xbox One, Series X, S, Xbox One X, like even with the ones with the good freaking uh, hardware and stuff, it doesn't work right. It still that skips. So I don't get how they did that. I don't know what happened. Like once it catches up with itself, it's fine. Final countdown. Oh, that's me, Johnny Bell. Let's go. Coming Let's up on your right. Bellicom the really frick is that thing? I mean, it looks cool as hell. No way I'm missing this. Motherfuckers are gonna pay for Isla Lazar. Look at your chance. Solovetsky's two clicks out. All units, EMP in transit. Starfish inbound, 400 knots. When that baby hits, we'll have 12 minutes max before the radio towers come back online. Our job is to knock out the AA guns and give our warbirds a clean shot. Okay. Let's take Perseus off the air. You got it. Ease. I got 33 of these. I think I can't even hit these guys. You are hurt, get the cover. My god. Push up, push up, go, go, go. I could imagine this game on like the veteran or realism, whatever the hell it's called. Like the very, very last one. What do we got an M M4? A gun, straight ahead. Take some of these dudes out in the windows here first. I don't see anybody in the windows. Right, let me move up here. Okay, pushing up here. I got you, bro. Well, I guess I'm not Woods or Mason, but... Hold on, wait for it. Plan it! Here. Have you cleared the AA 
Ooh, we need to launch these bombers. Love this gun, dude. You know that's not good enough. I can't risk an early strike. We only got one shot at this. You don't think I know that? Just be ready to launch when I tell you, Hudson. Let's do the damn thing. We're going this way. Contact. He's out. Shoot in his head. Got him. Dude, this those guys right there would be so hard on realism. Because those guys just tank on easy. I could imagine. The power's coming back on. There he is. I died. I died. Hey, I died. So, okay, we're back where we were. I'm gonna start moving up here a little bit. Try to get some of this. Ooh, minigun. My goodness. They should have put this on multiplayer. Where you think you're going, dummy? Okay. Need to plant C4. I'm working on it. I can't move. Dang. That had like 30 seconds. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. But we can just skip all this. But now I'm trying to catch up with itself. I can't. It won't let me freaking skip it. Is that really it? We stopped them. Those towers are history. What's your situation down there? Come in. Woods, have you found them yet? Over here. Give me a hand. Take my hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah, after capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East, and with our resources behind him, we should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. What about Anton Volkov? After his death, elements inside the GDR saw an opportunity to reduce the Russian mob's influence in East Berlin. Two days ago, in a large-scale midnight raid, Stasi swept through the homes of anyone with connections to Volkov. Men, women, and children 
were all gone before the sun rose. This will be a major setback to underground Soviet activity in Europe. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azalea's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. Stop. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance, which of course we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? We may have saved it from the getting cool the kingdom come, but it's still stacked with persons many agents. Bones. There's more we could have done there if we'd had the time. And Bell. Okay, what? <laughs> Arctic air. There's the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that, kid? Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. I didn't like that guy from the beginning, to be honest with you. Huh. That's it. I, I'm telling you, man. They freaking nailed it. They nailed it. You know what I would like to see them do? Is, you know how they give you DLC packs for, um, multiplayer? I think it'd be cool to see, like, a season pack. For, for single player, like actual, like more missions. I know they wouldn't do that because they gotta continue making games like every three years or whatever to continue the story. Which I get it. But I think it'd be kind of a cool idea to like pay like $10 or $15 or whatever the hell it is and continue the story. Um, I don't know. I think it'd be kind of cool. And I'm also excited to see where they go from here because in Black Ops 1, they went to Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 2 was more the futuristic stuff. So I wonder if they're going to try to mimic the same idea, or if they're just going to continue off of the Cold War era, or a different era in general. So I'm excited to see where they go with this. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. So as you guys, my name is Johnny. I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode, or next video, rather. Uh, a few more days till Cyberpunk, so yeah, see you guys soon. Bye.